tell this message to your friend to keep in mind as Christians, God have no problem healing us. He's able to heal us. But in addition to healing us, I think God much rather his children be healthy, stay healthy, and remain healthy than to have this revolving door. We're back and forth. We're here today. Tomorrow we'll say, you know, it's like a revolving door. So uh, I know God had given his message to a few uh, Kevin Zida, Neville Sado. I've heard them over the years, and it's true. And myself, I'm guilty of the same thing, but we have to also repent in that area. Yes, granted, it. The time and season we live in, the world that we live in, they have poisoned most of the things. But that does not mean we should fold our arms and give up and say, well, let me just, you know, eat junk. We have to also try our best to eat healthy and clean as natural as possible. Mm -hmm. With that being said, God does not want his children to be like a revolving door healing today, tomorrow, back and forth. That's why he created all these herbs and vegetables and fruits. And he gave some people the wisdom to create an event, vitamins and minerals and supplements. So if you have those things handy and available, we have to utilize them daily. Those things have to be a part of our lifestyle. We shouldn't even take them when we're sick. That's not the time we should take them. I mean, we should take them when we're sick. But the point is, the sickness should not be the reason that motivates, motivates us to take those things. Everybody should have in the refrigerator. If you don't, please, we need to do it. Always have vitamins, all natural, search online, search your local area. This is message of a verse for everybody else, myself included. Search online, search Google. I've said this before, I'll say it again. Search online, search Google, search everywhere you can find and find yourself a natural, organic, health food store that is locally or you can purchase online. But search and get yourself some really good, very potent, strong, liquid multivitamins look for zinc look for iron and get you some chlorophyll uh what else that's all i know of him for now and take those things like some of you are familiar with my immune boost i sell them and some of you who live far out of the country i've shared the ingredients with you i say go make your own and always keep two three glass i have at least two bottles in there one is they're both uh, 32 ounce which are pretty huge. I always keep that in there. And those things, we can stay in the fridge, the immune boost. Once you keep it in the fridge and you don't put a, a dirty spoon, you use a clean spoon, it can last six months, sometimes to a year in the fridge. Yes. Mm -hmm. I always have it. Now we're going to winter season. You know they're going to cook up some kind of stuff and release it. They will call it corona. They will call it monkey pack. They will call it the flu. They will call it whatever they want to call it. But if we already know these people tricks now, then it will be foolish of us not to prepare ahead of time. Then they always be reactive. We should be proactive. Number two, number three, if you and your friends should try your best, do not take the flu shots. Because the flu shot does not prevent the flu. From day one, when the inventor introduced the flu shot to humanity, it has never cured the flu. Neither has it prevented you. Because what was that in that flu shot is exactly what they're giving you. Exactly what the name of the shot is, what they're giving you. So we can't be willfully, deliberately knowing this information and then injecting ourselves with these things. Then we get sick, then we want prayers. What do we want prayers for? I'm not saying that's the case with you or your friend, but we have to also have wisdom. Because we make God look like we, his children are always sick, they're always praying for healing. And, but we have things available to us. So, beloved, we should be the one that should be in the optimal, topmost health. I'm starting with myself, I'm preaching to myself, I'm just sharing with you, with you guys. We should be in the topmost health. So God have no issue healing his children, but this back and forth, back and forth, God would much rather his children be healthy and stay healthy. We know a few things to keep us healthy. Let's stay on it. Chlorophyll, zinc, iron, all those things. I usually get mine liquid. Now they come in pills. I prefer liquid. Why? Anything in liquid form when you take, it goes straight to work. It goes on contact. It starts doing its job. If it's in any form like pills or capsule or tablets, it has to first, your body has to first break it down and then begin to distribute it to where it is needed within your body. But if it's liquid form, it enters your system. It goes to work on contact. You may not like the way how many things taste. I don't really care for the taste anymore because I've trained my brain to say, listen, it may not taste the best, but it's good for my body. And once I take a, a shot of what a zinc or iron liquid taste 
some people say it tastes nasty yes i put some right away i drink a glass of water and i squeeze a little bit of honey on my on my tongue and rinse it out with some water i'm good but it's worthy we can't be praying for healing all year over things that can be cured naturally if the body is giving what it needs i've told you guys many times do your juice and your smoothie because your body needs the juice it also needs the fiber from the smooth from the juice you do one or two days one or two weeks you give it up no juice and smoothie because if you just do the juice what's happened to the fiber nothing god created goes to waste the fiber in the fruits and the vegetable your body also needs it it's not just the juice so we must do a combination do your juice i do my juicing on the weekends on my days off i will batch juice i may have like 10 bottles of juice 10 bottles of smoothie in my fridge at all times I think I'm, I'm down. I have a few more to fill. Once I see the last two or three bottles is almost is left in my fridge, it's time for me to refill. I drink two or three of that a day. 16 ounce each bottle. Drink two or three of that a day. You want juice and smoothie recipe? I can send them to you. You can search on YouTube for juice and smoothie recipe for your immune system to clean your liver, clean your kidney, to give you energy, to heal your bone marrow, to grow the cartilage in your bone, bone to give you better, beautiful, glowing skin, hair, skin, and nails. We have so much information on the internet. There's no reason any of us should ever be sick or to be ignorant of keeping ourselves healthy. There's so much information out on the internet that you can pretty much learn anything from your bedroom if you want to learn anything, I mean anything. How to be healthy, how to lose weight, how to heal yourself, mentally, physically, spiritually. We have so much information. I'm not saying we shouldn't pray, but in addition to praying, we must start eating healthy, living healthy, taking vitamins, taking minerals, and stay away from the people toxic vaccines and all the foolishness. Seriously, I beg of all of us, okay thank you